Hi. This week I'm exploring organisation's response, what I'm observing and hearing. Organisation response to the future of work. And while some organisations are embracing what everyone's saying is going to be the future, which is hybrid working, there are organisations that are vehemently resisting and putting their head in the sand. And yesterday I talked about the procrastination. But then following the procrastination, which is step two on my little infographic here that you can see, just get everyone back into the office now. So rather than continue the procrastination, organisations are saying, get them back. First of June, they're in the office. And I think this is why I believe this is because when we don't know what to do, it's often easier to go back to what we've done in the past, what we know, than go forward into something new and what's fairly uncharted territory. So there's a knee-jerk reaction happening. And the organisations I talked to who were saying, yep, yeah, everyone's coming back in the office, and I asked the question why, I get very vague responses. Why do you need everybody back in the office? despite all the productivity gains and flexibility gains and employee satisfaction we've seen during 2020 and 21. So I get things like, oh, well, it's a culture thing. No, it's not. You don't build a culture based on physical um, locality. Then you say, it's a productivity thing. No, it's not. People were actually, the researchers said people were more productive working from home. Um, they had more time back on their hands. And if you think it's a productivity thing, it's probably because you need line of sight of your employees to think that they're produ pr productive. So some scary um, things going on. So they're issuing this decree and this is going to have serious consequences for a lot of organisations. Employees have had a taste of the freedom and the flexibility and the improved work-life balance and the increased time with the family, the reduced commute, the reduced cost, the increased time on the hands, all of those things due to hybrid working and working from home. And organisations now want to issue a decree, a decree that that is over. People will tell you that they're not happy and they will start to walk. And I'll talk about that tomorrow. See you then. Bye.